A bicycle on the Beijing Strait in 1985. A man buying stock in Shanghai in 1986. A fisherman in Fujian Province. Those pictures are all taken by Yan Leima, a French photographer who spent 30 years in China. He now calls himself Yan Lei, and his work gives a glimpse into yesterday's China. I don't buy news. I don't buy journalism. I buy the day-to-day life part of it. So now Chinese people like to see my old pictures because they remember that 30 years ago life was just like that. Besides Chinese fans, Yan's image also inspired foreign photographers when published in magazines. One of the most famous series is On the Railways. A wave of photographer enthusiasts came to China to shoot for themselves. That time, many foreigners who came to China to visit the East were inspired by the Chinese film. They came to visit the East Coast to see the East Coast. They came to China in 1985. 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 From there, Lema started his journey across the country and even to the most remote areas. Oh, many places in the country I've never seen foreigners. I think this is impossible. You must be a ghost. You say, "Ah, you're a ghost. I'm not a ghost. I'm a foreigner. I'm from the outside." I walked a thousand miles in one day. In 2004, Lema held a large-scale outdoor exhibition in Luxembourg Park in Paris, featuring photos that spanned 20 years in China. The next year, because of his prominent contribution in the Sino-France Cultural Exchange, he was awarded the French Legion of Honor medal. So many foreign photographers are working in China, but no one focuses on the change of China so constantly in the past 30 years like Yan Lei. He recorded so many changes, so many people's lives and their emotions are shown precisely in his pictures. Pushing environmental protection is a current focus for Lema's camera. He says he's trying to persuade people by recording moving moments like this. After 30 years in China, over 600,000 shots. Lema believes the very essence of China's beauty lies in the harmonious coincidence of humans and nature.